The 5G network is said to be the next generation of mobile wireless networks to serve the country, which will eventually replace the 2G, 3G and 4G networks. Minister for Communications and Information Technology Timothy Massieu commended this initiative, adding that it is important for PNG as it is estimated to increase the country's GDP. From an economic perspective, it is estimated that the introduction of 5G will roll out appropriately with and will also boost uh, domestic mobile technology and services with a potential of contributing an additional 4 to 6 percent GDP. Chief Executive Officer for B-Mobile Athula Bianwila says the 5G network will benefit PNG tremendously, especially in sectors of agriculture, health and education. Uh, I think for PNG, um, the agriculture sector would benefit uh, enormously with this technology. And, uh, you know, it is the time with the Coral C2 cable coming in, uh, it is the right time to bring these new technologies. Yeah. Right? So um, with the Coral C2 cable and 5G, the agriculture sector uh, will benefit enormously and we can leap from technology straight into the 5G. <coughs> Bian Wheeler added that B-Mobile will be working closely with NICTA and Huawei PNG to ensure that the 5G network is deployed successfully next year. Meanwhile, Chief Executive Officer for NICTA, Charles Punaha, says 2G, 3G and 4G network users will be given adequate time to adapt the 5G network. Whilst we will uh, provide for the deployment of 5G services, we are also going to allow the uh, existing services that uh, we have extensive coverage uh, time to uh, migrate from 2G, 3G to 4G and 5G enabled services. Minister Messieu also urged B-Mobile to prioritize better rural coverage and quality of service. Pamela Barrara, National MTV News.